check this out folks this rock at one time was probably up here and it fell and just slid down and it's just hanging on there hanging on these little boulders and stuff it's just amazing because it's huge it's huge just all about four or five folks on horseback doing some healthy horseback social distancing <clears throat> like like we are saw some folks walking everyone was keeping a good healthy distance and it's it's just another day in the woods virus free One of my favorite shelters out here because this the shelter overhangs up this like rock and just creates a cool little tunnel tunnel effect inside <laughs> and just if it was raining this would be the thing to be under <laughs> most definitely michelle just found four pennies and a washer she found a nickel at millstone lake so she's nine cents richer but this is a cool uh shelter and it's just this big big piece of bluff it's just hanging and it just it like hangs off there it drapes off there hanging over the side if ever falls it's going to take out that tree you know but i kind of want to name it wax shelter because people they melt wax and ride up all over the the bluff and all that but it's always been a it's always been a favorite favorite place to see it's just a neat little bluff line out in the middle of nowhere but we are starting to approach jackson falls of our hike we'll go through jackson falls all the way and then loop back out and start heading towards tin whistle again all right folks here's probably the the gist of any waterfalls we see today little trickles just little little trickles up there which is fine didn't really come out here for a waterfall hike came out here because it's just so, so scenic it's it's the long way to Jackson Falls. That's what I tell people. This is the long way to Jackson Falls. Lots of pretty wild flowers all over the place, including up on top of Bluffage. Isn't that cool? Little bees in there, pollinating. They're all over it. Isn't that pretty? It's a whole pretty area. Big Bluffage all around this is like the quiet part of jackson falls and for you climbers out here there's plenty of uh climbing hooks and stuff like that for your carabiners thank you beta fund for putting in this there's some information in case you want to pause and read it. And there is Betafun's website. And it's a backboard. As well as a first aid kit. And hopefully you never have to use any of this stuff. But if you do, the Hellespot is up there. Where the medical helicopter will come get you and fly you to the hospital since you broke your back <laughs> so be careful and here's a rear waterfall up there's a wooden bridge and then right over this way is dog walk so we're at jackson falls the main jackson falls attraction so it's flowing a little bit the main one may be looking a little better All right, folks, cool little shelter. I 
bunch of little rocks and stuff hanging out there. All sorts of looking like uh, layers. Pretty neat. Alrighty, folks. This is right on the trail, but it's a cool little waterfall system. Kind of trickling right now, but I bet if it was really heavy, heavy rain, it'd be pretty neat. But it's almost like stairs going all the way up. Just a lot of green. Oh, don't mind me, Mr. Bluffage. Let me just bend out of your way. <laughs> now, wild tree just grew up and went away from the bluff. <laughs> when you find a crack, you gotta walk through it because you might find Michelle. <laughs> you're, you're lucky the sun's shining and can't see you. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Ah, uh, got got to walk through cracks in a bluffage. Just walk three step. There could be a hole, especially when it's all leaf covered. A hole, or sometimes a snake. <laughs> sometimes. Ah, oh, there's the bluffage. Ah, oh, we had a pretty good time in there, mm -hmm. seeing all sorts of stuff. You made it. <laughs> Busted. <laughs> so as an alternative, if you don't want to climb the hill, the tin whistle, you can go through there. Michelle. No. <laughs> I'm good. Might be a little wet and slimy. Because it's old. Uh -huh. This is unfortunately this part of the trail. <laughs> Man, when when the mud when the mud is so bad that the horses have to make a new trail, <laughs> then then it's, you know it's bad. <laughs> Alrighty, folks, we are out of the trail. It was a fun hike altogether. Let's see here, twelve miles Woohoo! 12 mile hike 45 flights climbed 22,221 steps and it claims we lost 12 miles, today. 12 miles. Seven and a half miles yesterday. yep seven and a half miles yesterday so we've done some we've done some exercise yep. this weekend horse riders are gone just me and michelle michelle chamel Really? Chamel Jean. Quit. <laughs> <laughs> yep. And I see my bike tire in there, so I still have my bike. Thank you. Tires. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, all four tires. All four tires are still secured. So, cool deal. Oh, I see a note. <laughs> I've been left a note. <laughs> Someone has left me a note. Hey, hiking with Sean. I enjoy your help for info on. Um, let me see here. Let me see here. Oh, social media. Have a great day. My Insta is Leah Winter. Dot seventy seven. So there's your shout out, Leah. Leah Winter dot 77 so thank you leah and i'm glad you watch my stuff so that was the video folks if you enjoyed that video be sure to like and comment on this um video and share it with others especially on social media it really helps out when y'all do that and if you're not a subscriber please subscribe today and if you do I'll send you a signed autograph picture of Michelle. Oh. <laughs> I lied about that, so don't don't <laughs> expect that. <laughs> so, thanks again for watching another episode of Hiking with Sean. Until next time, Michelle, see you on the trail. You are in so much trouble. And the next video is going to be 
20 minutes of nothing but Michelle. Mm-hmm.